Tired of low FPS, stutters, and lag in CS2? In this video, I'll show you how to unlock full CPU power, boost your FPS, and fix every lag and drop using Secret 2025 tweaks. Follow each step to make CS2 run smoother, faster, and better than ever before. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Gear Up Booster is a best tool to reduce your ping while playing games. It works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it for free from my description and enjoy smoother gameplay with lower ping. Step 1. Maximize CPU performance by unlocking all processors. In this step, I will show you how to unlock all CPU cores to maximize performance. Press the Windows key, then search for System Configuration. Open the program and navigate to the Boot tab. Click on Advanced Options, then check the box for Number of Processors. From the drop-down menu, select the highest number available. This setting ensures your CPU uses all its available cores, improving system responsiveness and performance. Once selected, click OK, then Apply, and exit the menu. Now your CPU is fully optimized, ensuring higher FPS, smoother gameplay, and lower input lag while gaming. Step 2. Optimize your power plan for gaming performance. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. In this step, I will help you optimize your power settings for better gaming performance. First, open the Windows search bar, type Power, and select Change Power Plan. If your power plan is set to balanced, it limits your CPU performance, which is not ideal for gaming. For better performance, switch to either High Performance or Ultimate Performance. If you don't see Ultimate Performance, you will need to enable it using a special command. First, copy the command provided in the description. Then, open Command Prompt as Administrator, paste the command, and press Enter. A message will confirm that Ultimate Performance mode is now available. Now go back to Power Plan settings and select Ultimate Performance from the available options. This setting ensures your CPU operates at its full potential, preventing FPS drops and improving overall gaming performance. Step 3. Making your CPU work better by unparking CPU cores. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Your CPU has many cores, but sometimes some of them are parked, not being used, to save power. This can slow things down, especially in games or heavy tasks. To unpark the CPU cores, you need to install a tool called Unpark CPU. Unparking cores makes sure all CPU cores are working, giving more power to games and heavy software like Fortnite or CS2. Once you install the tool, right-click it and choose Run as Administrator to give it full access to your system. When it opens, it will show which CPU cores are parked and which are active. To turn on all the cores, just click the Unpark button. This helps your computer use all its power, which gives a big boost in performance. Step 4. Removing telemetry for more privacy and better performance. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Telemetry is a feature that collects data from your computer and sends it to Microsoft, which can impact both privacy and system performance. Once downloaded, open the program and apply only the recommended settings. If prompted to create a restore point, you can skip this step since a restore point was already set earlier. Disabling telemetry might affect features like clipboard history and storage, but if any issues arise, you can use the Undo All Changes option to restore everything. Finally, select Do Not Show This Message Again, click OK, and you're done. Removing telemetry ensures that your system runs with fewer background processes while also protecting your privacy. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping while gaming. So first, download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Fortnite. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the End tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let Gear Up automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally, close the window and launch your game using Gear Up Booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 5. Optimizing System Memory Using ISLC program, the ISLC. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Intelligent Standby List Cleaner program helps free up RAM memory to boost system performance. 
First, set the list size to half of your total memory. You can check your total memory at the top of the ISLC program window. For instance, if it shows 32,000 maybe, type 16,000. If it shows 16,000 maybe, type 8,000. Next, check the boxes for Start ISLC Minimized and Launch ISLC on User Logon to ensure that it runs automatically. On the right side, enable Timer Resolution and set it to 0 0.5 error. The ISLC polling rate should be set to 1000, but if your system is slow, adjust it to 1000. After modifying these settings, click Stop, then Start, and finally click Purge Standby List to complete the process. This will clear up RAM, prevent slowdowns, and allow your computer to operate more efficiently. Step 6. Making your keyboard respond faster with filter keys. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Setter in this step, we will improve how fast your keyboard responds using a tool called Filter Keys Setter. First, open the Filter Keys Setter program. Inside the program, adjust the settings like this. Set, ignore under to zero or no M's. Set repeat delay to 130 and that's stems. Set repeat rate to 10 M's. Then, look on the right side and make sure the checkbox is ticked. After everything is set, click OK to save the changes. These settings make your keyboard respond faster, helping you play CS2 with less input lag. Step 7. Disabling startup applications for faster boot and smoother performance. In this last step, you will turn off programs that automatically start when your computer turns on. This helps Windows start faster and gives your system more power to use for other things. First, press Ctrl plus Shift plus ESC to open Task Manager. Then click on the Startup tab. Here you will see a list of programs that start automatically when Windows loads. Right-click on the programs you don't need and select Disable. This reduces background activity, speeds up boot time, and makes your system more efficient. Turning off startup apps is one of the easiest and most effective ways to improve your computer's performance. If this guide helped you, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more gaming and PC optimization videos. I'll see you in the next one.